Aqua is a two-year-old tortie. She was a transfer from another facility here in New Jersey. She has been in my foster home for about two months. Um, her health is in good condition. Her shots are all up to date and she has been spayed. As far as her personality, I would say she is both a delicate soul and an affectionate cuddle bug. If you see her right now, you can see that she totally loves these little ear scratches she's getting. Her favorite spot actually is, is right here along her cheeks. Um, and it's, she's an affectionate cat. Um, you will find that she doesn't like to go the whole night sleeping alone. You'll wake up in the middle of the night to see that she has cuddled up next to your head. Um, she actually doesn't even, <laughs> that's, it's actually her second favorite spot right here. She actually doesn't even like to go um, a full half hour, an hour without um, saying hi to you if you're not in the same room. If you're both doing your own thing in separate rooms. She'll come out to your room and say to meow and then pick a spot in your room to lounge. And that's actually her um, favorite thing to do is lounge. Just like she's doing here, she's a lounge cat. She. I think in the past life she probably was a beach cat, you know, because it doesn't seem to matter to her where she is, if it's the bed, if it's her little perch, if it's her, um, if it's, you know, actually on the floor or under a plant, she is lounging. And um, it doesn't matter if the sun's out or if, um, if it's completely dark in the middle of the night, I'll come out to the living room and find her lounging under the plant. That's just um, her her favorite thing to do no matter what um, her favorite treats are actually the greenies and the temptations catnip flavors uh, you can see I've actually mixed them in here with both greenies and catnip temptations um, the greenies I like because um, it keeps her breath fresh Oh, there you go, honey. I know. And then her favorite treat would be these catnip temptations. I have actually seen her um, wake up at 4 a.m. in the middle of her deep sleep to eat these just because she heard the bag crinkling. There you go, sweetheart. Yeah. Aqua, though, would do best in a home that doesn't have other pets um, and doesn't have any small or loud children. And the reason for that is, again, she is a delicate soul. She needs um, owners who are going to be gentle souls with her and who are going to take the time to earn her trust and make her feel safe and secure. You can even see right now a little bit from her body language. She's a little weirded out that I'm doing something she hasn't seen before. Picking up this phone, holding it, you know, towards her and talking to it. So, um, you know, she's kind of taking a little bit of a defensive position here on her, on this perch. Um, but otherwise, if you are the type of owner who can be gentle and take the time to earn her trust you'll discover that she's an absolute sweetheart um, she's not only affectionate you know i actually nicknamed her lady Mimsy around the apartment just because um she's so the way she walks is so poised and the way she interacts with things is so poised um if she's curious about something she'll just lift her head just ever so slightly you know, like an elegant British lady, and um, sniff, like she won't swat at it. She, I, I've never seen her um, knock anything over. I have not seen her, um, in fact, you know, if you tell her no once, she will stop doing it immediately and won't ever do it again. So she's uh, one of those elegant, well-behaved, very poised um, ladies, so. My hope is that she's going to find owners who, again, are going to be gentle and take the time to get to know her. And come here, Lindsay. There you go, Lindsay. Yep. 
She's a little weirded out by me right now. Yeah, so my hope again is that she's going to find owners who are going to be gentle with her and um, give her the time and the environment for her to um, develop some trust and um, also appreciate like what a lady and affectionate personality she really is. If you're interested in learning more about Mimsy or Aqua, um, you know, you can reach out to Liberty Humane Society and uh, send in your questions or request an application.